Hello and good morning all. Get some sort of, get some breaking news out of the Supreme Court and probably if you're watching this you already know about them overturning OV Wade. This is now official, it's not the leak document. But before I get to that, I'd like to thank all my returning viewers and subscribers. And if you're new, um check out my other um videos and see if you like what I do and subscribe. Now on to it. The Supreme Court on Friday overturned Roe v. Wade, effectively ending recognition of a constitutional right to abortion, giving individual states the power to allow women or ban the practice, uh, which I do not like. I'm, all, even though I'm very conservative, I'm, uh, I'm more often than not side with Republicans. I think this is stupid. Bloom came in. Uh, the ruling came in the court's opinion in Dobbs v. Jackson's William Health Organization, which centered on Mississippi's law to ban abortions after 15 weeks of pregnancy. The Republican-led state of Mississippi asked the Supreme Court to strike down a lower court ruling that stopped a 15-week abortion ban from taking place. We end this opinion. Opinion as we begin, abortion presents a profound moral question. The Constitution does not prohibit the citizens of each state from regulating or prohibiting abortion, both in case it arrogated their authority. We now overrule these decisions and return the authority to the people and the elected representatives, just as Samuel Alito wrote in the court's opinion. Alito's opinion also with exploration of and criticism of Roe v. Wade and is holding that while states have a legitimate interest in protecting potential life, this interest was not strong enough to prohibit abortions before the time of fetal viability, understood to be at around 23 weeks of pregnancy. What did not explain the basis for this line, and even abortion supporters have found it hard to defend Rose reasoning. Alito spoke. Chief Justice, Justice John Roberts agreed that the viability line never made any sense, but said he would ta would have taken a more measured course with this case rather than overturn Roe v. Wade altogether. Roberts said he would have continued to recognize a right to get an abortion, but the right should be extended far enough to ensure a reasonable opportunity to choose, but not to extend any farther. The court majority took a firmer stance against Roe v. Wade in the subsequent case, Planned Parenthood v. Casey, holding that Roe and Casey must be overruled. Uh, the Constitution makes no reference to the abortion and such and no such way is an implicitly protected by any constitutional provisions, including the one which was the defenders of Roe v. Wade, Roe and Casey now chiefly rely on the due process clause of the 14th Amendment, a little vote. The court's opinion recognized that the 14th Amendment due process clause has been found to be guaranteed certain rights that are not spelled out in the Constitution, but that those rights are deeply rooted in the national, nation's history and tradition. Abortion, the court said, does not fall within this category, and such a right was entirely unknown in America law well, until the late 20th century. The, the opinion continued to shred Rhodes' decision, saying it was egregiously wrong for, from the start and that its reasoning was expansionally Week. Yeah, I just think it's bullshit. Uh, I think it's gonna end up having people riot and cause a bunch of. There's gonna be protests over this. The protests are gonna turn into riots. People are gonna get hurt. People are gonna get killed. Business is gonna be burnt down. Uh, yeah, they should have just. If they. They should have, if they wanted to do anything, they should have said no abortions after uh, 23 weeks. I think even uh, anti-abortionists, majority of them can agree with that. But now, with it's gone, 
And some states saying if you go to another state to get an abortion, we will prosecute you, which is bullshit. Yeah, uh, they shouldn't have did this. This is... I... The reason why I'm... Pro choice is not morally or anything. It's economic, like I said in another video. I'm for abortion because in the long run, it saves us money. So what do you guys think? Are you upset about it too? Please let me know down below. And if you made it this far and you like what I'm doing, hit the like button and subscribe. It's always good. Have fun. Stay safe. Bye-bye.